Leave it. Ah, leave it. Leave it. Put my hand out like this. Leave it. Sit. Then I'll do it again. Leave it. I'll go real slow. Leave it. Okay. I'm going to do like a little rolling of the frisbee. I'm just going to kind of flick it like this with my wrist down on the ground to make it roll. And she's, it's kind of like a rabbit, like a, some, anything running away, bird, rabbit, whatever. I'm back, uh, back at the school again. Uh, I haven't mentioned any names for now, but anyway, here we go. I'm going to roll it, see if I can get this on video. This is kind of difficult. Try to maybe roll it her way. Okay, ready? Fetch! Patty girl! Hey, 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 hey! All right, here, hey! No backup. Good girl! And what I'm doing there, too, is when I'm backing up, I'm hitting the beep. All right, good. Play a little tug, get her excited. All right, tug. A little more tug. Good girl, hey, hey, hey. Give her a little hey, hey, because that's kind of like her revving her up. I'm sorry, this is probably making you sick again. Uh, sit, sit. Good girl, I shouldn't have to say it twice. I did it wrong there. Give, give, give. Good girl, good girl. Ready, send me fetch. Yes, all right. Hey, hey. Come. Hey, hey, hey. And I'll hit the beep while I'm doing that. Yeah, all right. Come here, girl. Come here. All right, all right, all right. Give. I say give while I'm saying this, but she's still learning that pretty good. Give. Pull up on the collar. Yeah, all right. She gave. I say yes, good. Yes, good. I'm not even going to make her sit right here. I'm just going to have fun because she kind of seems like she's a little bogged out. Ready? Fetch. Hey, hey. Good girl. Come. Good girl. She's bringing it right back to me. She'll put herself in the heel position, but I'm not doing that yet. I shouldn't say yet. Right now, I'm not. Give. Good. Yes. Pet her a little bit. Sorry. All right. Sit. Sit. I need to pet her just a little bit. Sit. Let me just say yes. Good girl. Had a girl. Rub her on the chin. Rub her on the belly. She's got her vest on, so that's not the same effect, but... I just rub her on the head. As soon as she does a little lick right there, that actually means that she acknowledges it. It's kind of dog talk, dog psychology. I'm not a, a certified dog trainer by any means, but I kind of do knew that, knew that just from watching videos. <clears throat> Back to playing fetch. All right, hey, 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 fetch. Get her excited. Yes, all right, hey, hey, yeah. She'll come back, I don't even gonna say come. I also don't need to say because I have the beep. Yeah, all right. All right. She's tired. So am I. One more. One more. Play a little, a little tug. Hey, yeah, yeah. Let's actually run a little bit. Get her excited. Yeah, back away a little bit. Yeah, all right. Give, give, give. Good, yes. Good, yes. Hey, hey, hey. All right. Hey, fetch. Yes, good girl. Nice catch. Caught the frisbee on that one. All right. Yeah, she's running a little slower back, so I can tell she's she's tired. Her pace isn't the same. So what you want to do there is you want to end it on a good note. She still wants it, but I'm going to keep her wanting it. So keep her enticed. Keep her excited to play the game. We'll leave it at that. I can make her carry it back, but a lot of times I won't. She likes to, and sometimes I'll let her because it's her prize, but a lot of times I'll take it away so that she really wants to play fetch again. You want to end the game with your dog wanting more so that next time when you pull out the frisbee or the bumper, your dog is ready to go. All right. Thanks, you guys. Keep watching. Like and subscribe if you do like this. Bryn B. <clears throat> uh, yeah, I'm from Tigard. Just a little background, a little Tigard. Tigered Oregon. Same with Sammy. Sammy's a COVID dog. She's about two years old. Then uh, I say COVID dog. That's kind of silly, but she kind of was raised during the COVID pandemic, and so she didn't get a whole lot of um, socializing with other dogs. But she's, you know, she's a golden retriever. She's uh, extremely kind-hearted, kind-spirited. Loves other dogs. I'm not worried about her at all. She likes the game of fetch so much that I don't have to worry about her <clears throat> taking off and playing with other dogs, which is pretty rad, pretty cool. Uh, that's because the e-collar, no matter how you look at it, she would love to take a, take off and go play with any other dog, but 
she's pretty much trained to do you know the fetch and so if she wants to play the fetch over going playing with dogs she wants to play with me over playing with dogs and fetch just kind of goes along with that so it's tug people say don't teach your dog tug that's not true tug is actually one of the best things you can teach your dog reason being is it's the best one-on-one -on -one thing you can do up close with your dog your dog's right in front of you you're playing one-on-one <clears throat> -on -one is the best way to put on it or to put it you're playing one-on-one -on -one with the dog when you throw a, a ball for a dog or you play fetch it actually disengages the dog because your ball your ball runs away from you and so your dog runs away farther from you which disengage uh you from your dog so with that being known play a little bit of both get them excited about playing tug let them win nobody wants to no nobody wants to play a game with somebody when they lose all the time let your dog win uh e collars the way to go you can get one for about a hundred and something dollars from one of your local stores you know your sporting goods stores um get one watch the 10 minute video on how to tra train your dog and if all you want to do is learn how to save your dog's life which i say all you want to do i mean that's the main thing obviously but if that's the main reason you want to save your dog's life get one learn how to uh recall your dog which when i say recall i mean come uh recall your dog back to you is what i mean you know come or here or come here however you want to teach them they'll they'll, they'll learn both if you want to do both but i like one word personally uh your dog will learn like i said you do you do both of them and your dog's smart enough he's going to pick up on both of them um like right now she's over there sniffing on something and say we're at the beach and it's say a jellyfish or a crab i don't want her to get stung or, or pinched so sammy come i hit the beep beep good girl save her life right all right seven minutes i'm rambling uh i'll make another one watch like subscribe please if you like these hit like and subscribe keep watching you guys and i'll keep making these uh yeah, enjoy. Take care.